Hi right, YouTube users, this is a tutorial on how to do a round off back tuck or a round off layout. Now, even though a lot of people don't need to use that punch, I can do fluidity. If you haven't seen my fluidity tutorial, check that out. But I'm going to demonstrate a round off back tuck first and then a round off layout. Alright, now a round off layout. Okay. Basically, if you can't do a round off well, then you need to work on that first, all right? If you can uh, try standing back flip and get as close enough to where you can land here, then if you can use the rebound of the round off right, you can probably do that uh, round off back tuck before you do uh, uh, the standing one. Now, the key to the round off, when I first started, when I went into a round off, I would kind of go off to the side like here before I punched off. So what you really want to do is focus on your legs. So if I was going at a dead on angle, you want to kind of go you know, like a cartwheel, plant your feet together and push off. Now if I do this slowly, if you're here, push off your hands. Ooh, that was kind of sketchy. But when you're, once you're in the handstand part, we'll round off, put you about here, bring your feet together, and then push off your hands. Now, let's see, it's kind of hard to demonstrate it slow. So let's see, I'll do one real quick. I'm going to slow this down so you guys can see what I'm doing. So the side angle. All right, and then from a dead-on angle. Whoa, too close. All right, all right, let's see, um, the round off. Handstand position, bring your feet together. Turn your legs at first, kind of reach out, push your hands and feet together, and then push off your hands. And don't let your heels hit the ground. When you let your heels hit the ground, you put too much strain on not only your heels, but also your ankles. So work on basically try not to let your heels hit the ground. When you punch down, keep your trying to like stay in this position here. That way, when you land or when you push off your hands to punch, that when you try to stay here, you feel that the uh, weight and pressure coming down will bring you down because if you try and stay here, it'll spring you right back up. That's where you get a good enough height to get up. Now of course you have to push off, and sometimes if you're good or if you know how to control it, it'll happen. As for the backflip part, for a layout, I basically just arch my back. You see, you haven't seen my backflip tutorial, check that out, all right? Because that's really important, or any backflip tutorial. So you punch off the run off, come back, I go up, I always tilt my head back. Some gymnasts say it's not good to tilt your head back. For me, it works, all right? If it works for you, tilt your head back, try it. If it works, uh, keep your head facing the other way, then try that. I go back, tilt my head back so I can spot the ground. Once I'm all the way over, once I can see the ground, I point my legs and basically just, just play them down there. Again, when I land though, I don't land uh, flat, all right? I land on my balls, the balls of my feet to cushion the landing. For the back tuck, it's kind of the same thing. I go up, tilt my head back a little bit, and then I tuck. And that tuck will bring me around enough time to see the ground and I spot. So I'm gonna do a run off layout. Just wanna be in slow motion. Okay, and then a round off back tuck. Be in slow motion as well. Now there's two, there's two ways to tuck. A few ways. One way, grab the knees, other way, grab behind the, uh, the legs. Whichever way works for you, okay? And again, like I was saying, uh, so I'm trying to start to say in my new tutorials is, if something's not working for you that I mentioned in my tutorial, figure out what you're doing wrong, what you would do to fix that, and then think of things that you could do to fix that, try different things out. But again, if you're still having problems, though, contact me, anybody you know who can do whatever I'm doing in the tutorial. And then that's pretty much it. That's the uh, tutorial for round off backflip. Thanks.